Seneca, a Roman philosopher, stated in the first century AD, it is the power of the mind to be unconquerable. This nugget of knowledge is still relevant today and, in many respects, forms the basis of how a Sigma male views himself and his life. Sigma guys are frequently extremely talented and skilled people who draw notice from others because of their distinctive approach to problem solving. The people around them can detect that a Sigma guy thinks differently and realize there is much to be learned from penetrating these lone wolves' minds. And while being born a Sigma male is a rare occurrence, any man can adopt Sigma male habits into his life to make positive changes and become his best self. So we're going to explore 10 of the Sigma male habits you can implement into your own life to become your very best self. The Sigma male is the one who does not identify with a certain place in the hierarchy. Moreover, he uses the hierarchy to his advantage. He loves freedom, independence, and solitude over status, money, and fame. A commitment to communication, communication. Sigma men are not by nature the most talkative of all men. They are the lone wolves of society and do their best to keep other people out of their affairs. They rarely try to be heard unless they believe it to be very important, and they would prefer to watch from the sidelines than draw unnecessary attention to themselves. They are therefore not always the best at speaking out for themselves. Yet Sigma males are intelligent, and they know the extreme importance of clear and honest communication. They know that it is important for them to communicate well when the time comes, and as a result, they form a commitment to developing their communication skills. Sigma males understand that the better they become at communicating with others, the better they can express themselves and make real changes in their surroundings. Accepting what lies beyond their control acceptance. Although Sigma guys are notorious for preferring to have the most control throughout their own lives, this does not mean they are unaware of their limitations. Sigma guys are not frightened to tackle areas where their boundaries lay since they are aware that there will always be things in life outside of their control. Sigma guys learn to let go of aspirations or desires that are beyond them and develop the art of acceptance. They make a habit of focusing their attention on the things they can change, and in doing so tend to get a lot more done than those who walk around life with their head in the clouds. Building, Self-Sufficiency One of the Sigma male's top concerns in life is developing a strong sense of independence. The majority of Sigma guys find it difficult to feel secure when they believe they are dependent on other people. They devote their time and efforts to ensuring that they are as self-sufficient as they can be in life and only request assistance from others when they are genuinely interested in doing so. Sigma men are not afraid to evaluate their level of independence. They are willing to confront exactly what it is they need in life, and in doing so try to focus their efforts on being able to provide as much of that as possible for themselves. Those on the outside may mistake the Sigma male desire for self-sufficiency to come from pride, but in fact, it is a deeply ingrained habit that pushes them to be the best version of themselves possible. Picking themselves up when they get knocked down, persistence. The men of Sigma are not the type to give up easily. They view failures as chances for improvement and, in contrast to most others, find energy in struggle and challenge. Male members of the Sigma fraternity are experts at getting back up after falling. Sigma guys have a creative and imaginative way of thinking, and they frequently use this talent to solve any issues they come across. Early in life, Sigma males make it a habit to embrace challenges as a learning opportunity and become experts at picking themselves up when they get knocked down. Taking time for repose reflect on things. Sigma males are genuinely aware of the value of having some alone time. Many Sigma males spend time and effort keeping a private area that serves as a sanctuary where they may go to refuel and take pleasure in in-depth reflection. Sigma males need time to contemplate because this is when they get their inspiration and come up with all of their best ideas. Even those without a home of their own can find a moment and a spot to unwind and think. While working in his studio, the assistance of Leonardo da Vinci, who was one of history's most impressive Sigma males, said that throughout the day the famous polymath would suddenly stop and stand still, getting lost in his inner thoughts. After taking these spontaneous moments to reflect, this is when the artist and inventor would have his most creative ideas. Sigma males make sure to take time by themselves to let their minds wander, and this is often where they find their best inspiration. Being honest about their fears honesty. Although Sigma guys may appear calm and collected on the outside, it would be incorrect to assume that they do not experience fear or worry. Because they are also people, Sigma guys are susceptible to insecurity and fear. Sigma males, on the other hand, are honest with themselves about their worries and phobias and don't try to repress them in the hopes that they would vanish on their own one day. Sigma guys address these worries head on since they are aware that everyone experiences some level of fear in life. Sigma males are honest with themselves about what causes them worry, and make a habit of confronting these anxieties before they grow to an unmanageable degree. 
This attitude allows them to continuously overcome their fears and is part of the reason why Sigma males are so good at remaining in a state of constant self-improvement. Maintaining Discipline The locus of control, which is a technique important to how Sigma males live their life, is a concept from the Stoic philosophy. The degree to which a person feels they influence how their lives turn out is referred to as locus of control. People who have a high external locus of control think their environment has a big influence on how their lives turn out, while people with an internal locus of control think their choices and internal circumstances have a bigger influence. Because they approach life with an inbuilt independence, people with an internal locus of control are much less inclined to comply with the expectations of the people or society around them. Sigma males possess a natural internal locus of control, and that is why they are so confident walking their path in life and rejecting the judgment of others. They follow their passions and instincts and are firm believers in their ability to create the changes they wish to see in the world. While this is a naturally occurring aspect of the Sigma male mindset, developing an internal locus of control is a habit that can be practiced by anybody as a way of gaining a deeper sense of control over their lives. Reflecting on the nature of their mortality, reflecting on morality. Sigma males are under no pretense about their place in the world and don't let ego cloud the reality of their worldview. Many people in society fall prey to the same egotistical urge to think of themselves as the center of the universe, or the main character in the TV show that is life. Sigma males understand that one man is just that, one man. He sets expectations for himself that are built without ego and takes his mortality into account. Reflecting on his mortality helps the Sigma male to understand and appreciate the true value of the time that he is on this earth. Sigma males meditate on the nature of their mortality and make it a habit to use this as motivation to change and become the best version of themselves possible during this lifetime. Embracing the act of learning, keep learning. Male Sigmas have an innate intelligence and a feeling of curiosity about the universe. These characteristics are channeled into a lifelong passion for a study that they exhibit. When an issue arises that they are unsure of the answer to, Sigma males love researching the topic and trying to put everything together since they don't like the feeling that they have knowledge gaps. Sigma males are great problem solvers and often love to challenge themselves with brain training activities like reading or playing chess. Sigma males value their intellectual thirst highly and make a lifelong habit of feeding this thirst. Making the act of learning new things a habit is a way to keep life interesting and constantly develop a new and better version of yourself. The just do it. Mindset just do it. Sigma guys are aware that if they want to do something, they must stop talking about it and start doing it. They like to deal with the issues that need to be resolved as soon as they arise rather than putting them off. Sigma males have a strong habit of adhering to the deadlines and objectives they set for themselves. They are not inherently prone to procrastination. Many people have lofty ambitions, yet they frequently put things off to the point where they never achieve their goals. Sigma men break this behavior by getting things done right away and resisting the impulse to put things off. He goes left when the majority goes right have your way. The Sigma man is a rebellious person by nature. Except when there is a valid reason, he does not follow the crowd. He can be friendly and love social events, so yes. But in the big picture, he prefers to do things on his own. The Sigma male is aware that being led like sheep by a shepherd frequently results in herd behavior. Additionally, he feels unsuited for the majority because he despises authority. When he travels he avoids the big tourist attractions. When he goes for a hike he prefers uncharted areas. He is rarely susceptible to hype, trends, and mass hysteria. This does not mean that he denounces the world. When he feels like he blends in. He knows the herd, he knows how to act like one of the herd, and he even knows how to dress, talk and think like the herd. But he is not part of the herd. And that's his secret. He often goes on dates. With himself embrace being alone. For most people life consists of many relationships. These could be relationships with colleagues, family members, friends, classmates, and even with a religious community. While a Sigma male might enjoy social interaction, he often longs for some time alone. When he travels home from work, especially on a Friday night, he looks forward to a nice, long, intermission from the busy, noisy world. In solitude, he has a million things going on. He may be working on a business, or a creative project or perhaps he is reading a book. He might enjoy taking solitary walks in the forest early in the morning or going for a swim. No matter what, he enjoys his own company. He travels alone somewhere far, far away travel alone. It is customary to travel or go on vacations in groups, or at the very least, in pairs. However, the Sigma man frequently opts to go alone. About five years ago the first time I traveled alone. 
Closing the front door of your home and realizing that your journey has started makes you feel great. You start your voyage with a trolley and a tiny rucksack, far from your job, your hometown, and everyone you often hang out with. Actually, traveling alone is not just a solitary matter. It could be, but I have experienced that when I travel alone that I meet a lot of people. Traveling alone generally makes you more receptive to strangers approaching you. Also, the majority of people cling to each other when entering unknown places. The Sigma male, however, rejects such behavior. He steps out of the safety bubble and faces the world on his own. He takes care of his body and mind take care of himself. The Sigma male uses a considerable portion of his alone time for his physical and emotional well-being. He is dedicated to maintaining his physical fitness through exercise, and his refrigerator is stocked with nutritious foods. He may be perceived by others as being egotistical and self-centered for making such an effort to maintain his health. But he comes to understand that looking after himself comes before helping others. He is aware that leading a healthy lifestyle also contributes to mental health. One of the most important factors in this lifestyle is sufficient quality sleep. So he makes sure that he gets it. He might even meditate to calm his thoughts. When his body is rested and his energy is charged he is ready to challenge life again. He keeps silent when he doesn't understand he is not shy. Many people have ideas about topics they don't fully understand. They merely want to appear intelligent or to be in charge of the conversation. However, the Sigma guy will only contribute to a conversation if he understands the topic and has something worthwhile to say. Furthermore, in his opinion, speaking less often is preferable to keep your mouth shut. When you talk non-stop, you not only miss out on important information, but you also don't listen. Knowing one does not speak. He who talks does not know. By keeping silent, the Sigma male not only prevents disturbing a conversation with nonsense, he might learn something meaningful. There are exceptions to the rule of course. We all get in a charting mood sometimes, engaging in nonsense talk that's just for laughs. I guess then it's fine to talk out of your ass. He only talks when he has something to say. Purpose. Many people tend to talk about unimportant topics or to express their thoughts on subjects about which they are largely ignorant. But not the masculine Sigma. He uses precise word choice. Like their alpha counterparts, Sigma males don't just speak when they want to appear intelligent or to dominate the conversation, instead, they only do so when they have something significant to say or when they thoroughly comprehend the topic at hand. As far as a Sigma male is concerned, it's far better to keep your mouth shut rather than talk incessantly about nonsense. If you are talking all the time then there's a risk that not only are you talking rubbish, but you may be giving away valuable information which would make you more vulnerable, but also, you're not listening, and if you listen, you're more likely to learn something meaningful. There are always exceptions to the rule of course, when around close friends, chatting nonsense just for laughs is pretty normal and even a Sigma male can't take life seriously all the time. But generally, the Sigma male lives by the mantra, he who talks does not know. He who knows does not talk. He travels alone. A Sigma male loves to spend time in his own company. He doesn't need other people around him to have a good time, he has a more enjoyable time when he has the freedom to do his own thing. So, it's not surprising that when it comes to traveling, the Sigma male often chooses to travel alone. One of his favorite things in life is the anticipation of beginning a new adventure with nothing more than a backpack and himself, away from his job, hometown, and the same people he sees every day. You may wonder whether the Sigma male will get lonely traveling alone, but on the contrary, the Sigma male realizes that traveling alone makes you more receptive to strangers, which leads to you meeting a lot of different and interesting people that you probably wouldn't meet if you were already in a group. This is because people who travel together will, in a sense, cling to one another for comfort when going to an unknown place, making them more likely to close themselves off from meeting new people. The Sigma male does not engage in such behavior, as a person who likes to take risks, he looks to step outside of that safety bubble and face the world alone, open to all adventures that come his way. He takes good care of himself. A significant component of what constitutes a Sigma male alone time, is the time to take care of his body and mind. A Sigma male knows the importance of staying healthy, even if some people take his dedication to himself as self-centered, but the Sigma male knows that he can't take care of others if he doesn't take care of himself first. If you look in his fridge, you'll find it full of healthy, nutritious food, and he is committed to staying in shape through exercise, whether that's pumping iron in the gym in his spare time, or hiking in nature, which of course, is great for the mind. Speaking of which, he understands the mind calming benefits of meditation and mindfulness, as well as the importance of good quality sleep, so he makes sure he gets enough of it. 
A rested mind and well-fueled, healthy body give the Sigma male the energy he needs to take on life and achieve his goals. He takes himself on dates. Society has the habit of putting a lot of importance on relationships with other people. Life consists of many of these relationships, whether they be friendships, romantic, work, or family relationships. What is often neglected though, is the emphasis on the importance of the relationship with the most important person in your life, you. The Sigma male understands this completely. He knows that in life the only person you can 100% depend on is yourself, therefore, it's important to nurture this relationship most of all. This is why the Sigma male values his time alone. That's not to say he doesn't enjoy social interaction, but on a Friday night after a busy work week, all he wants to do is close the door to the outside world and relax in the company of himself. On a Saturday night, he might even take himself for a drink, dinner, and a movie. Being a Sigma male, he isn't going to be bored when he's on his own. He is far more likely to have a lot of things going on which could consist of working on his own business, a creative project, planning a trip, or studying to gain new knowledge. If he's not busy with those things, you'll find him on solitary walks in the mountains, cycling through the forests, or going for an early morning swim. Whatever he's doing, if he's in his own company, he's happy. He doesn't follow the crowd, not a follower. By now, it should be clear that a Sigma guy is a nonconformist who deviates from social norms and expectations. Neither does he want the throng to follow him nor does he follow the crowd. He recognizes the peril of following others' directions as sheep are guided by a shepherd. He is aware that he does not belong with the herd because he does not respect authority. He disapproves of trends since he doesn't appreciate her mentalities or actions. He knows he doesn't fit the majority, and he likes that. If he travels, alone usually, of course, you won't find him hanging around popular tourist attractions, he prefers to go off-road, visiting the places no one else goes, exploring uncharted territories. Make no mistake, the Sigma male knows how to blend in when he wants or needs to, how to act, talk, and think like the herd, but he is not part of the herd, and that's what makes him so unique.